Renourishing beaches on the Sun Coast is nothing new, but the town of Lombok Key is trying something different in dealing with erosion. ABC 7's Rick Adams explains how the town is turning to concrete to shore up the shoreline. Well, I'm here on the northern end of Longboat Key where town workers have installed more of these concrete blocks. Now, these blocks are supposed to help protect the beach from erosion. Longboat Key officials are hoping these 100 pound blocks of concrete will help keep the beach erosion down to a minimum. On Friday, workers placed about a dozen of these blocks below the concrete groin on the northern section of the island. Another dozen were put there last month. The more of these blocks of concrete we have, the slower the, the water moves through and the more sand settles out. Bullock says Longboat Key was one of the first towns in the world to do something like this with what he calls a permeable adjustable groin. These groins and concrete blocks are in other parts of the island and they are set up to help secure sand in highly erosive beach areas. We located these groins to uh, do two things, hold as much beach as we can but also protect the upland structures. We've got buildings. Town officials say the these concrete groins and blocks are having an impact. The question remains how much of an impact? Beachgoers we talked with are happy to see the town doing all they can to protect their pristine beaches. I think it is so important and it, it's the first thing you notice when you come here. The beach is wonderful and to do anything you can to preserve it. It's so important. Sarasota resident Lilo Posey visits the Longboat Key beaches frequently. She says she's all for anything to help the beaches. I hope it does because we want to keep our beaches. Longboat Key Beach is absolutely fabulous. About $2 million was spent on these concrete groins and blocks, all of which is paid for through the town's beach fund. We have put sand down over the years here and it has disappeared sometimes in a matter of months. So the purpose of these structures is to hold that sand a little bit longer. Longboat Key town officials say they will continue to keep a very close eye on all this to determine how much of a difference these concrete blocks are making in the battle against beach erosion. Reporting from Longboat Key, I'm Rick Adams, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.